I was two months pregnant with my second son when Colin was diagnosed. The test results started coming back in favor of high-risk neuroblastoma. Our daughter Grayson was diagnosed with acute lymphoblastic leukemia when she was two and a half, and the child life specialist, Ashley, said, hey, have you heard of Austin Hatcher? And we listened to their story, and it hit home for us, and we knew that we had to be a part of the organization. Diversionary therapy is exactly what it sounds like. It is to give you a diversion from what has become your life. Yeah, I bought a door! We assembled the shelf for the door. We were learning how to lock and unlock the door. It is to give you an opportunity to do something fun, do something that distracts you from the things going on. Getting through treatment, by ignoring the prognosis and having days like today where you get to come as a family and focus on creating memories. They need occupational physical therapy to help restructure their sensei. Using wrenches and nuts and bolts is an opportunity for them to do the therapy without sitting in a therapy station. We have this suite, Explorer, which they provided for it has donated the car and we're doing the build. We have, we have stations set up behind us, so some will get to work on upholstery, some will work on the rack, some will work on the lighting. There's great satisfaction with that. There's also the, the cognitive, the, the fine motor skills that they're working on, and it's just a deviation from the things that they're going through. I would take the car to go to the river to go kayaking. Hey guys, you ready for an adventure? Yeah. Walk yeah. in. be able to escape the life for a little bit and pretend like life is normal. I think it's so important and I think the support of the whole family. This is the funnest surprise, right Madeline? Look at her mouth! A lot of people think that once treatment's over, everything's good, everything's great. And that's clear, that's definitely not true. We deal with the after effects now. Her body is just trying to get back to normal and the resources that Austin Hatcher has given us have been amazing. High fives all around. Yeah. We love kayaking. I'm shedding. I'm shedding.